welcome to the Nexus. Today we are doing Disney Dolls House issue 118. We are so close to finishing. Um, so let's have a look at what we get. So we've got bits for doing our front porch and some cushiony bits for Donald's room. Kev will show you those in a bit more detail in a minute. Uh, I'm going to go and start putting Donald's room together while Kev does the build. Okay, thank you, Kirsty. Now, just before we go any further, um, as you've seen in places like France, Germany and japan uh they were offered the extension so the extension would include the winter and summer wagon and then in, in in japan they've done an extra extension for the uh halloween now we collect our magazines from the news agents and um i can tell you right now officially uh we won't be getting the extension here in the uk i don't really know why um, it's not on the national database and so the national database is called the national file database it's free to use anyone can use it um, but that is the system that news agents here in the UK use to order magazines and newspapers and stuff like that on that system it doesn't show anything past 120 uh, it normally shows you three weeks behind and three weeks ahead and there is nothing past the 1st of May which is when the last issue is released uh, also as well um, in our packet here you will notice so this is the parts that we get you will notice there is a gap right here because that is where we would have got our very first parts to do our extension which is a little window in fact I can go ahead and prove that we we were originally supposed to get the extension but we never have and that is because in the magazine here in the uh, pieces supplied down in this corner here you will see this little window and this little ice covering that goes over the window here which sits in that gap there and in that it says please keep these pieces somewhere else safe for use in a future issue well, we haven't got that issue, and we never will. Um, there's a few, I don't really know why we're not getting it. Now, you can get it from France. There's various systems and how you can actually get it. There's a, a website out there where you can actually grab the uh, extension if you wish to do so from France. Uh, I used to, if you know, uh, and you've been watching the channel for very long, I did the Alien build originally from France. And I also did the Robocop originally from France as well. So you can do it and you can get it here to UK. So if you do want the extension, it's probably the only way you'll be able to get it. Now, if you're a subscriber, I also know that you'll be getting in the last box, instead of four issues, you'll be getting six issues instead of the standard four. Um, so the price of that, instead of being around £40, it was going to be about 60 because you've got the last two issues in there. Um... I don't know whether subscribers are going to be offered the extension. It's a bit bizarre if they were over um, news agents, but it just doesn't look it. My personal opinion, I haven't found the information out from Hachette, uh, but my personal opinion is that the Doll's House probably didn't sell as well, and that is why it's it's down to economics. Um, it, you know, it, maybe the, the cost of the parts to get it here, people doing it, because we knew some people... We're going to do the extension and some people weren't. We were never going to do the extension. There was a few people who weren't going to do the extension that we know of. And we know of quite a few people that were and were quite excited to continue doing it. Um, it doesn't matter about the extension though because once you get to 120, the whole build is done. It's finished. Um, the extension is just a little extension on the front of the house to build the summer and winter wagons and to turn the house into christmas themed so it had like christmas trees decorations lights all that sort of stuff and then after that there was there's a second one which is actually happening in japan at the moment which is the halloween one which is a halloween sort of 
I don't know, sort of shop face big thing. And it allowed the house to be dressed up for Halloween. Obviously, as well, it came with lots and lots of extra characters. Um, and obviously tons of accessories, which obviously we will not get now here in the UK. Uh, but yeah, unofficially, you can you can get it from other countries. I'm sure there's ways out there getting it from Germany as well. Uh, I only know the place to get it from. Uh, thing. Um, but yeah, we were never due to do the extension here on the channel. Um, we thought the main house was perfect the way it is. Um, and um, it meant extending it and we haven't got the room and there was other factors as well. Um, but yeah, the only the only reason I can see they're not doing it is that um, it, I, I personally, I can, I can only see one and that's an economic one. So it's, it probably cost the, the cost of doing the parts and the extension outweighed the cost that they were going to get back. That's the only way I can see what's happened there. But anyway, we'll get past all of that. We've got two issues left after today and then the house is absolutely complete. So we're really close to the end now. So Kirsty's now finishing off Donald's room. We're going to finish off the porch. We've got the front of the house as well we need as well as this part as well because we're going to be doing a lot of gluing on this we need some, some super glue as well i've got my trusty super glue just here so let's get going and build 118 okay so let's open this up and i'll give these these cushions to kirsty but i believe they're sort of um uh, they sort of reference chip and dale so these are like nuts though so they look like something else i'm not going to say what they look like it's you lot that have the mind, <laughs> that mind, um, you know, yeah, I'm not going to say that. Um, we also got this one as well, which is weird. It's got a double side on it. It's It's got plastic inside. It is cushiony, but it's got like a weird on both sides where this one, these ones haven't. Um, yeah, they're just like scatter cushions that get thrown in there, but I believe they are reference to like Chippendale. Now, the reason I say that is because in the magazine, uh, normally we get something that sort of references them, and we've got that, as you can see, there, Chippendale as well. Um, yeah, I also believe in the step in the extension, one of the characters or some of the characters we were getting or you were going to get worse chip and dale so there's there's a lot of characters you're going to miss out on not doing extension okay so we're building the the sort of front porch area so these are all the pieces that we need just there we've also got these little designs and we'll do that at the end but um yeah actually we'll do those bits we'll do these bits first i'm going to throw those to kirsty so she can have them I'm going to bring over the main part of the front of the house because that's the part we're going to do. Move the all over that. Up. Let's bring the front of the house over. It's looking rather good. Okay, so normally I'll just twist these off like that. You don't need a special tool uh, to twist these all off. They're all the same. So these are sort of decorations for the front and uh what we're going to do is we're going to we've got we've got a hole here a hole there a hole there so all we're going to do is just glue into this little recess here like that like that and like that and we're going to place these on so the spike section is facing up not down, like so. The spike section is facing up. There's one. And there is the other one. Like that. So we're going to leave them just to dry, uh, like that. And now we can put this aside because we're now going to be building our front porch okay so we've got all these parts here now test fit everything uh, to make sure we've got the right parts so this part is going to go in here this one has slight 
uh, sort of nook in it and so does this one so first what we're going to do is glue these two sections together and then we're going to glue them onto there like that so I'm going to go ahead and do all that now so I'm going to glue into this recess around this recess and the same here I'm going to glue into this recess and down here as well and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick these two bits together and stick these two bits on like that so that's our first bit done okay next what we're going to do is we've got some upright supports here so we need to stick the longer sections in like that uh, once again we're going to glue them so we're going to glue these two and then we've got a larger one here with the larger hole in there or oh, is it that way it doesn't matter which way actually so i'm going to go ahead and glue all these on okay so we've done that we're next going to grab these two sections so this section here with the, the sort of uh, patterning on it and then this section here and we're going to glue that in so what i'm going to do is just run a bit of glue over this section and this section just here and this is going to sit in like so so that's like that and then we're going to glue the whole areas here so just uh, put a little bit of glue around the whole sections and then this is going to sit on these bits just here there goes the first bit now it is there we go it's just about positioning it before it sets i'm happy with that okay next what we're going to do is we're going to grab this section here and we're going to grab this section uh this section just here so this section here has the pillar on it but just a little knot notch just there and then it's going to slide into here so we're going to glue this into this section like so that sort of fits in and then next what we're going to do is we've got this section here and then we're going to do the exact same on this top section here I believe so I'm just going to slide that into there and uh, so we've got the two sections on there. Okay, so we've done that. So that's that part there. And then we've got this bottom part section. So what we're going to do is put the um, pillars in. So we've got two for this side. So what we're going to do is just glue around the top here. Put in the double ring section like we did before. Like so. And then we've got this one here. So we're just going to glue it around this bit. And once again we're putting the longer section in so it matches so just like that we're then going to glue this section on to here like that so we're just going to glue around here again and I'll marry these two sections up so they are like that at this point it's quite fragile um next what we're going to do is we're going to grab this section just here and we're going to glue around these belts just here once again long sections in like that and then this part here is going to go on the top there so we're just going to glue like that and this section is going to go into here so just push that down okay so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to place this we're going to glue this onto here and then this one is going to sit on the side there so i'm going to do that okay now. and there we go so it is 
really fragile actually like this I don't even know if it will survive me tipping it let's hold it a little bit so you can get a better view there it is like that uh, it is best to test fit everything to make sure you've got the right pieces in because it's quite easy uh, to get the wrong pieces in the right the wrong places um, so test fitting is a is essential um, because uh, all the pieces only go into the certain there is uh, obviously there's little nodges and holes uh, as you saw me gluing and they're only specific to where they need to be so some are straight and others are like sort of slightly to the left and they will only go in sort of one way but there it is. All done. So let's take it over to the house, see what it looks like on the house, and we'll see what Kirsty's been up to. Okay, so Kirsty's been busy doing it. Now we did say this is the most cluttered room. We did think it was gonna be the yeah. kitchen, but actually it's turned out to be this room because it's sort of set up like a beach scene. Yeah. Um and it's just all loosely placed in there. Uh you'll see it in a minute. So Kirsty, uh, let's reveal. There we go. And he's got some ghosts. Visiting. Yeah, we've, uh, like I said, we always add a little quirky bit to it. And this time we've added a family of ghosts. Because, you know, he is kind of in the attic. Because, yeah, it's in the attic and we thought it would be a good place for the ghosts to go. And uh, they're all having a, a, a day at the, at the beach. At the beach. Now, there is a lot of stuff in here. There's a yeah. load of these pillows and we've just literally chucked them in there. Uh, we've obviously stuck up a few bits, so we stuck up those yeah, bits and that. Yeah, some bits are stuck up. Some bits haven't stuck as well as we would like. There's an anchor around there. There's a sort of a palm yeah. tree there. Um, there's all these little jars lying around. These, these sandwich sort of basket. There's these sandwiches up there. Once again, we've done the sound. The the stuff on the little the little table we've stuck on with glue dots. Yep. And we've stuck the stuff up here with glue dots on. Uh, but all the stuff at the bottom here is loose. One of his, the uh, blue thing. Yeah. Yeah, they're they're supposed to go on the on the on the um, on the walls, as in with the picture, aren't they? On the, yeah, they sort of stuck on the on the uh, on yeah. the walls. Um, they're they're incredibly heavy. And very difficult to stick. And very on. stick. Uh, so we've just placed one there, and obviously one's fallen already. But yeah, we've got the anchor here. We've got that extra little bits but yeah they're sort of at the beach um having yeah. a picnic i love the the um the donald figure it looks really cool hang tight or hang loose is what they call that sign that he's doing he's got his uh things there as well and there's a little sandwich spike there that he's obviously eating already he's got his cocktail there but that is our our room now we've only got two rooms left which yep. is uh the bedroom cinderella's room and the Ariel's room. Yeah, but we'll uh, talk about it in just a minute. But uh, that is it. So let us know what you think in the comments of this section, and we'll see what's coming in the last, in the next issue, as I say, yeah. not the last one, the next no, one. That's... So let's see what comes in issue one hundred nineteen. Okay, and that is it for issue one hundred eighteen. So what comes in one hundred and nineteen? In issue one hundred nineteen, we've we're going to attach the roof section to our porch. And then attach it to the front of the house. We also get the last part of the um, bathroom, which is the toilet for uh, the um, uh, Little Mermaid room. And that will finish off that room. And then there's only one issue left. Um, one part's left. Um, but yeah, that is it from us here at the Nexus. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing to the channel uh, and keeping up with the build and everything like that. We really hope you enjoyed um the stuff we will be doing a final video uh, obviously we've got two left so stick around uh, but we will be doing a final video as well as issue 120 we're going to do an extra one that just breaks down everything what we thought of the build and stuff like that so make sure you click subscribing also as well take a look at all our other content because we do lots of uh lots of model builds and other stuff on the channel. So you might see something that you like. So don't go anywhere. But anyway. Until then. Until next time. Thanks for watching. Like. Subscribe. Like. Subscribe. Thumbs up. All that sort of stuff. Uh, comment as well. Let us know in the comments what you think. Uh, about us not getting the extension. Let your 
let your feelings know. Email Hachette as well because um, they've taken this decision with really without not consulting us. But, you know, that is what it is. Uh, but anyway, look, until next time, guys, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.